What is up everybody, it is Og here, back with another video, and in today's video, it's gonna be pretty short. I want to announce that we're gonna be going for the world record again, when you can watch it, what we're gonna be doing, and go over some of the criteria for the actual world record itself. So, on December 12th, at 10 a.m. Eastern, so in six days from now, we're gonna be starting the world record attempt. This is gonna be a, an assisted one to 60 world record attempt. The current record is held by Zegers. There have been shorter slash played times, but not real times based on the official site, which is speedrun.com to assess whether or, not, whether or not somebody actually beat the time. So we're gonna be going for a time to try to beat Zegers, but also gonna have a little bit of a personal challenge that we'll go into in a bit. But if you guys haven't heard about this, definitely recommend checking out the stream, twitch.tv slash Arleus, hitting the sub button down below, and then make sure that you hit the notification bell next to it so you guys can be notified of when these videos go live. We've been talking about it a little bit though over the past week or so. We are doing a ton, a ton of prep for this world record challenge. It is going to be a ton of fun. It's going to be a very long grind, and I am streaming the entire thing nonstop. So if that's something you're interested, definitely check it out on December 12th at 10 a.m. Eastern. Let's go over some of the criteria of it and what I'm actually going to be going for. So I want to take a sec to kind of go over what the actual world records are, right? So we have a few categories. And so if we go to speedrun.com and then go to the WoW Classic site, we have 1 to 10, 1 to 15, 1 to 60 solo, 1 to 60. And then within 1 to 60, there's actually two different categories. So if you go to 1 to 60 solo, this is going to be, you know, purely on your own, right? We're talking no trading, no auction house, no grouping, none of that. Now you can do an aided category. And so this aided solo category, for example, that would be with some components. And if you're ever curious about the specific rules, you can go up to this view rules section and you can see that you can use, for example, mailbox auction house trading. So there's different criteria for different, you know, records and things like that. But the one that we want to focus on is the one to 60. And so within the one to 60, we have two categories. You can see down here that we had an initial time of 50 hours, 37 minutes. And so that was six months ago, a couple of weeks after we did it, Breesty and Zegers beat it. Zegers with a time of 36 hours and 12 minutes. So Zegers crushed it. Now there's a new category with the one to 60 empty. The reason for that is that after this happened, they implemented the lockout period, right? So 30 instances per day. And so both Zegers and I, and I'm sure Breesty as well, basically used a lot of instances, right? We, we ran a ton of instances. I'm not sure the actual number, but that's how we leveled up. Now we're not gonna be able to leverage those instances as much. And so that's why they made this new category of one to 60. And it doesn't have anybody yet. So this is technically where my record will fall under and will technically have it. But I wanna go for the overall thing. So I wanna go for better than 36 hours and 12 minutes. My goal is 24 hours real time. So we're gonna start at December 12th at 10 a.m. Eastern, which I believe is 4 p.m. Central European Standard Time. Uh, and then we're gonna try to finish by that same time the next day. A lot of things are gonna have to happen for that to happen. But we have a lot of plans and hopefully we can pull it off, we're gonna see. But if you're curious about where we're getting the rules and everything, these are the rules. The timing starts immediately as soon as we log in past the intro cutscene. So I can make the tune first, I just can't log into it yet. No breaks or whatever can take place. If I take a break, if I nap, if I go out for a run, whatever I do, that counts against the time. So I gotta make sure that I'm going, going, going. It's gonna be a lot of fun though. I'm excited. I'm looking forward to getting back at it and hopefully we can pull off sub 24 hours. 